Flooding? What flooding? One of the problems with moving your boat around in the winter sometimes is that sometimes the pounds, that's the measure of water between two locks, runs down and gets pretty empty. In which case more water has got to be let down. I mean there's plenty of water as you saw earlier on at the start of this video, there's plenty of water further up the canal but it has to be managed correctly. It has to be repumped around, recycled and uh, pumped back up to the summit so that it can go back down again. And unfortunately, sometimes people move around in the winter time and leave the paddles up. So then a pound like this can just drain overnight. Now the blue boat behind us there, uh, they were here at about eight in the morning. Uh, we've been here since about 11 and the pound here is quite large. So uh, it's taking a while to fill. The CRT guys are, are here. They've been here early. Um, obviously it took them a while to uh, realize that the pound was empty and to come out here, but they're doing a great job. So that's fantastic. Now, the sad thing is that there's a lock house right here. Um, traditionally, uh, the lock keepers who lived in those houses uh, would genuinely, you know, just keep an eye on things. Um, and uh, now they're all in private ownership. At least it's not raining. Okay, we're on the move again after a two hour delay. That's boating. When the pounds are this low, I worry more about the bridges because that's where people drop stuff. Like fridges and things like that. Nice. Very low. Very low. Moving an 
powerboat in the uh, rain is possibly the worst. I prefer it when it's cold to when it's raining. So, we've gone as far as we can go today because there's uh, lock closures. <clears throat> Donald Trump is visiting the UK and uh, because he is, uh, they've closed the lock and an entire stretch of the canal and towpath. Best friends, Sally, and a new one. No, who's a puddle? Hey, Bruno. It's a good job we're slowing down because. has no water at the moment. Look at that. 